Hey guys, it's Nick from Retro Games HQ, and today I'm playing another episode of Koromon. Yes, the Koromon demo. So far, it's really fun. Can't lie, it is really, really fun. Very well done. So let's get back into it. And if uh, no, you know, you are. I can tell if you're watching this, you probably already watched other Koromon demo episodes. So go ahead and subscribe for my channel. Uh, for uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already uh also if you're in the market for like i've said in other episodes if you're in the market for a game want to help charity and want to support this then go to nicksonar.com forward slash humble bundle almost okoed them um humble bundle to go to humble bundle which helps with uh when you buy a game they give to charity and because you're going through my link you're also supporting this channel to no cost uh, uh to you extra cost to you so um Get this off my laptop. I would greatly appreciate that. And let's get back into it. All right. So Silk Quill needs to be switched. Remember, I am bringing them all up one level. Okay. Hmm. What? Okay. Um. That's mofo. Give me uh, one second. I want to check. Mofo. I, I didn't get to read. I saw something pop up. Daggum. So I can't catch it. That's not a perfect. That's just a potent mofo. But this is what's cool about Coromon as well. They have normal, potent, and perfect. And it's pretty much shiny, and then like ultra shiny kind of deal. You know, like what Pokemon does now with the shiny and then the square shinies. So, but this actually has more potential. It's all about pretty much your IVs, pretty much. And they just have more potential, so I think you can add more points. So, it, it's extremely interesting. Let's get into it. Let's see. Cut. I need to get a chart printed or on my phone or something. I got robbed? Punk? Alright. Alright, there we go. Finally getting... So he is... I think Sand... So, sand, if you're attacking with a cut against sand, there's no um, multiplier. So, it's just regular. So, again, here's the tops for Coromon. Not the top, the move tops, but for Coromon. That is normal, electric, ghost, sand, fire, ice, and water. Now, here's its move types. Normal, electric, ghost, sand, fire, ice, water, magic, foul, heavy, air, poison, and cut. So, you have one, two, three. You have seven Cormon types and 13 move types. An interesting concept. Here's my potential stats. So, as we've already talked about, um, my... Special attacks up. I think no, that was a different one, didn't wasn't it? Okay, so this is so you can also see if you click right here, you can see what you've put it into before. And I've done a pretty balanced, like I don't know, kind of deal. <sighs> and I still don't know. My attacks kind of going up, so I'll go one, one, and you know what? Minus that. I'm going to go defense. So one to my attack, one to my defense, one to my special defense, just because I need to play a little bit defensive. you got to be smarter when it comes to this. Remember, look at your SP. Coin snatch. That's pretty cool. Patterbit, gain 30 experience. You found 96. So I gained my money back. Kind of want to get another battle in, just for the heck of it. Ah, you know what? Let's go. 
All right, so I'm up to level nine now. I feel a lot more comfortable. A whole lot more comfortable. Not saying I can be carefree, but I can be a little bit more comfortable. Yep, there he is. So there's a one back here. Yep, 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 yep. gotta use push. And there's one in the house. Some of them just got to go around and look for them. Okay. Everyone's healed up. I meant to check, double check, triple check. Regular Beasel. Beasel, Beasel. Alright, go Silk Quill. Of course, my strategy is pretty much the same. Oh. Oh. Huh. You're literally still money. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna hit for man. I'm still at speed. I think I already said that his speed sucked. Maybe that was bad a bit. But I'm gonna decrease his speed. I mean his accuracy. Decrease his accuracy. Actually, decreased rage. It's fine. Cause I'm gonna. Miss. He's gonna miss. No, he's not. Oh, crit. Good thing I've hit him three times and he still... How many stages you got? I would think six if it's like Pokemon. So, out comes my squad. Here comes... Toruga. Tor, Tor. Freaking love this. God dang. Dude... Do you n ever not hit? And he also got critted. Okay, so three of them go down. 21. That's fine. I can use this eight times. Nine. Okay. <gasps> Yo, squad mate. Patter bit. Go. I'm guessing that, you know, when you decrease their accuracy, it does nothing, actually. So... That's cool. Because he's not missing a single one of these. What's well, pattern bit, by the way? Is, is this special? Physical. Physical. Knock down the target. Okay. That's interesting. So I'm going to go back. I'm going to go to squad. Toruga, not Toruga, sorry, Patterbit, and he's normal type, okay, so it is normal, fire normal, yep, okay, well then the choice is obvious when it comes to this, feelers, I am sweating only slightly. I have to. This is three. I have to have a chance. He needs to miss me. Of course he doesn't. I've only decreased his accuracy three times. That's fine. I just gotta... Oh, yes. Okay. I guess that was the thing, too. Let's see. Bam. Crit hit. Plus a 2.5. Oh, man. That's three. I'm... Oh, I'm... Oh, my God. When it comes to this stuff right now, I am extremely nervous. I know I'm not talking much, but honestly, putting it on insane mode, it's kind of got me on the edge of my seat. Oh, my God. Yep, 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 yep. Mm-hmm. 
Taruga, because I wanna. Actually, no, no, no. It's too much. <laughs> yes. Okay, it's gonna increase his defense. Pretty much in a pinch. Oh man. Let's go in here to see if there's one. Who knows, there might be one. Right here. Mm hmm Of course, I think it's out of the world to find a library, but, I mean, if you remember Pokemon Stadium 2, you had to fight in that like, classroom. All right, making sure he's not here. Yes, okay. After seeing that one in the house, I wanted to make double sure that there was none in the other buildings. And I gotta check. So cleared that. This is cleared. So I'm rotating right down. Right, I checked up there. But there is one in this house. Alright. Yep. Alright, Beasel. He's all, he's all. Okay. I've learned my lesson. Just attack, 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 attack. Yes, Beasel, Beasel. Because apparently decreasing accuracy. I want to learn more about the accuracy system. A seven is pretty good. I want to learn more about the accuracy system in this. So eight, seven, okay. Yeah, um. Twelve. Eleven. Poison. It's easy. Squad. Two. Send out. Um. I like to see the stages because I wonder if I just got stupidly unlucky there, where I knocked him down three accuracy stages. I want to remember other stats like who's fastest and all that stuff. I want to get acquainted with that. Fine. Because it's a kill and Patterbit does still get a little bit, though I will have to switch him in next time. Look at some of his potential. That's where I've already put so one zero special attack. <clears throat> I'm okay with where my SP is now. Definitely. Speed seventeen. Special attack of 18. Yes. Crew level 10. Uh, I need 18. Attack mine was 17. So Silk Curl's a little faster. Attack's 15. Okay, so. Better in the physical department. Now it's time to go back and heal once again. It's four. Guarantee there's like one or two more. Ooh. Thank God that I don't have to go like a ridiculous amount away. I just do this. I need to check in the back of their yard for a Beasel. So I have Silkwill, Taruga, Patterbit. Then you have Mawful. I think it's Mawful. What was the other one? Other ones. I'm trying to... Okay. I'm trying to remember, like, all the names. Which I understand. I'm also trying to remember Nexomon stuff. I'm also trying to remember Tim Tim stuff. And here soon, I'm thinking about Monster Tamer. Or, mon not Monster Tamer. Monster Crown stuff. 
Usually I don't buy. Oh, there's one. Usually don't buy early access stuff, but Tam Tam um, has a hard like goal and stuff. And Monster Crown can be held accountable because it's so much into uh, the community. Pe you know, it's like people hold it into account. It's not just going to be forever. Oh, my delivery. I didn't... Oh, my delivery. Oh, I thought you were someone for a moment. Uh, sorry about that. My name's Noah. I'm working at Teleporter that connect Havel to the fast travel network of Volua. I'm still waiting for the last few parts I need to complete the Teleporter. I ordered them from Luxolus Campus a while back. The package should have arrived by now. Oh, perhaps you were willing to help. Could you help find out what's keeping my package? Sure, I'll help. Great, I ordered the parts from 10 at Lux Solus Campus. Perhaps you could start there. I'll be in my workshop doing the final collaboration. Calibration. I'll be waiting for you. Okay, time to... I'll go to the stove to get that. Okay, I thought I could totally... Is there anything in here I could take? No. <laughs> yeah, so we can... Here, ho hold on. What's she saying? Uh, my husband has a workshop in his base in the basement. He's one of the few re he's one of the reasons our village is getting more technologically advanced. He's now so focused on his work that he's oblivious to the consequences of a teleporter in Havel. Perhaps progress isn't always a good thing. Now, oh. there's something to be said for tradition and that, but oftentimes there's multiple there's mul it's a multifaceted problem, but just look how people prefer it. You know, we keep take. You know, if people truly preferred overall on the mass scale for us to stay more from poor, that'd be the way it is. But they don't. It's for reasons, and they know. They recognize. You know, they have to feel the cultural effects. And they recognize it. and They know it's happening, um, but they still continue to make that choice. Not to mention, oftentimes this whole. I mean, I'm cool with tradition, culture, st you know, just, like, older stuff, um, values, like, just living in a simple life. But oftentimes, that means they, kids are struggling, you know, people are being able to, you know, they're worried about putting food on the table and stuff. It's all, really, you can have, the problem is, really, there's multiple problems, but it's a community, we just need better community, which there's multiple reasons, I would say, that's, Technological and political. Why wow, we don't have that, but Buzz from Diesel. Interesting note. And I'm, I'm wondering if any of these are even open to being potent or perfect. All right. Let's. Okay, I want to see the. Down, down, forty, forty. So Claw has also a. Claw has a 10% chance to decrease defense as well. So there it goes 8. There goes 8. This is only 2, so I can do that 12 times, but it's not really the problem. Let's It's a crit hit. Can't afford that. He's also poisoned, so I'm going to have to switch him out for pad a bit. Come on out, patter bit. Slam. Come on and slam. Uh, welcome to the slam. Propeller punch. Bam. Beasel fan. Awesome. 126. There goes to level 10. 35, 13. Attack 17 now. But my defense is 20. My special defense is 20. It's obvious I don't need physical. These physical attacks suck compared to what my special attack's going to be. My speed's down. Okay. Seal cool is 126. There's five. All right. Let's talk to this dude. This town's still up and coming, so there's no Cormon storage or shop for trains yet. Luckily, this Lux Souls campus is nearby, and once Noah's teleporter's online, we can travel there instantly. You know, it's just, just because technology comes about and disrupts things, first off, things have always been disrupted, but doesn't necessarily mean it's bad. And what that really means is that you need to have traditions that 
tend to, even though there's disruption, which is the world we live in, you know, even though there's disruption, uh, it needs to be, okay, yes, there's disruption, but how do we build communities? Is it, you know, um, putting people, pretty much helping with learning processes and passing them down and spreading them on how to, uh, my thing's moving. Mm -hmm. how, how can you grow a community and stuff like that? Which I think is pretty just regular human stuff. I mean, internet communities are, you know, just kind of came around without anyone directing them. And that's how things go. Plus, we're more connected than ever. So, communities can be wider. But um, there's importance to talking to your neighbors, things like that. Fruits can give your hormon an advantage in bells. Of course, I'm holding back a lot because this is a gameplay. So, they're also very healthy. Here, I'll show you some with you. Juba... Mole, burr, Coromon are smart enough to consume their fruit when they need it. So make sure you give them some fruits. I do want to see what those are. Pick fruit, mole fruit. Restore 75% SP when nearing exhaustion. Restore 50% when in danger. Okay. Oh, isn't there a burr? A burr fruit? Increases XP gain when participating in a battle. Hmm. It's an interesting one. Mm -hmm. I like that. That's why I decided to live here, being surrounded by beautiful nature instead of a city. Mm -hmm. Z Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Claw. So we get eight. That's seven. That's seven. Rage. His attacks up two stages. You could crit me. I'm also poisoned. So I'll hit first. Do fast strike. Yep. Level 11. So HP is 31. Nothing really increased. So speed is where I'm heavy at. And attack. So attack. That's where it looks like I need to put stuff into, but also my defense don't go up. It didn't. I don't like that. Get back to about fifty. Hmm. Awesome. That's pretty good. I'm going to. Ooh. First heal. Then I'll go to her. Oh, never mind. Oh, it's great to hear. Thank you so much for your help. We won't don't don't have much, but I can give you this stinky disc as reward. If you give it to the leading Cormon in your squad, it will help repel wild Cormon. Yes, I would like to take it. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right then. Ruga first. Probably get there. Items. HP kick three. I'm probably gonna make this kind of a long episode. Okay. Time to go back. Back to Luxolus. Remember, I am in on I am on insane mode, which is pretty much nuzlocke mode plus some like you can't teleport, um, things like that. What the <coughs> sounds that? Okay, Ooh, swarmy. Remember, I can't catch a perfect coralmon. 
So if I come across one of them, I can catch it. This could be Oko. Super effective also, because he's a... I think it's super effective. I got the chart pulled up. Let me look. Hold on. First, HP up. Speed up two. Okay, it's nice. Oh, I'm already 19, which means I'm next level at 11. I'm going to have a higher than um, Squilkle. I think it's the name of it. Um, text crap. Still. Special attacks up. So I do want to hit with those. Pattern bit. Six. Cool. Anyways. So he would be... There's no bug type. What would he be? What is... One second. So there's Nibblegar, Swarmy, Beazle. Yeah. Normal type. Which poison is two times effective against normal type, apparently. Okay, I like these birds. I just like the whole thing. Their trees are better than Pokemon trees. Their trees are better than Pokemon trees and Sword and Shield. Like, what the heck? Alright. Let's get these guys up to par. See? With, uh... Not powder bit, but is it Squill? Squill Quill? Squill Quill? Squill Quill? I think it's Swill Quill. I think it's Swill Quill. Come on, run, Manny. I said Manny. Mint Man. Nothing over here, making sure. I did not miss anything that I can now use with push. Okay. What solace? Kippis. Probably here. <laughs> right. So it's not here. There we go, this way. Ink will be there. Maybe it's here? Well, that's like your colleagues. Oh, what the heck? Oh. Okay, well, I can't do that. Huh. That's neat. Hmm. One second, I think I got a quest book, right? I got a log book. Hmm. Lux Solus Campus. I thought that was Lux Solus Campus. Lux Solus Lab. Looks, uh, so it's R and D lab. Come on, man. Is this the campus? Okay, thank you. So the whole thing's a campus, right? Right, right. So I went through there. I need to go back through, make sure everyone in the. Let me talk to Larry real quick. <laughs> no one there. Go in there for the R&D lab, because that's where I would think it would be. Yep, work, 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 work. Yep. Let's see. Gauntlet, powerful tool. Go ahead, trying to get into your stuff in. Access granted. Yep. Thank you. 
I still have stupid clothes on, don't I? Okay. Essence collector. Hello? Okay, bye. <laughs> okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. Before we develop this model, destroy a number of mock gauntlets. Oh, man. Talk to her. Clothes. I'm working on a new module, and I already tell you it's fire. Small Cormon live in grass caves. Yep. Marco, please don't disturb me. Trying to concentrate. Had a very great assistance. Just the settings. Person making spinners. That's why I'm more durable. I see spinners. Mm. Something there. I don't think so, but I'll check. Oh crap! Another look, Solus. No. Nope. Chose Taruga. Yep. I also chose Taruga. I'll ask them when I come back. How are you? I hope you're doing well. Noble Gar. Picking your first Cormon is difficult. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Maybe Cruise, we're arriving. Yep, here's a free coupons. You can use them to get a discount on your next purchase in any of our shops. Oh, freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. Sweet. Hello, are you Tim? Tim, that's right. Uh, I'm Retro Games. Noah sent me here. Oh, God, come on. He said uh, he ordered a package. I don't know who that is. Uh, he ordered a package for me, but it hasn't arrived yet. Oh, shut up, phone. Oh, that's right. I almost forgot about it, but just a while ago, I remembered to send it. Didn't have to go far. It should have arrived by now. If it hasn't been delivered yet, then the package must be somewhere between here and Havel. Perhaps you could take a look around Radiant Park. Okay, I'll do that. Thank you. One second, guys. Okay. Double check something. Here we go. To Radiant Park. Heck. I'm strong enough to evolve. Come on. Ooh. Some more EXP. That's what it sounds like. Silk Wheel. Toruga. Of course, I gotta put up. Um. I'm not putting. I've not been putting out Patterbit yet. For a reason. Because he's getting a little bit of experience off this. You know, all the seven experience. Still something. Let's talk about this guy. I'm trying to capture breaking out my spinners. Perhaps you could help me. Could you catch one for me? That would be help so much. Come back when you've caught one. Anyone? One second. I'm not doing that for a while. Come on, drone, focus. Remember what I taught you. We can a while come on to increase your chance to capture it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Is it this dude? Green's young child. Ranger. Evil. Be careful. Warren. Upcoming breaks. Okay, it's 
So it's gonna be package or is it gonna be a person? Come on, perfect. Mmm. Mino. Then fifteen SP. Down one stage of a of a defense. Okay. Down to eleven SP. That's fine. Fourteen. Oh my God. <sighs> okay. Let's see. Is this potent or perfect? Po I can't catch potent. I can only catch perfect. That's what insane mode's all about. You can only get perfect. Oh. That's fine. I'll KO him in the next cinder attack. There we go. 294. So they freaking spit out. EXP. Think of what perfects would be. Oh, man. So 29, 20. Attack 16. Special attack 21. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Pad a bit. Yep. Special attack defense. One, two, three. Yes. All about. <sighs> yeah, kind of curb your chances when you go in pretty much Nuzlocke mode. Hey, what you doing? Ah. Oh, sorry, I started you. I thought a wild Cormon jumped at me. Cormon? They only jump at you when you walk through grass. And don't you have your own Cormon to buy them with? Yes, I do, but I forgot to bring any healing cakes from and now my entire squad's fan. I can't go through the grass anymore. I'm trapped here. But I'll never be able to deliver this package. Uh, do you mean a package meant for Noah? Yes, but I'll never get there while my Cormon are fainted. Oh, I'm so stupid. Hmm. I can escort you through the grass so you can go to the trainer hub in the Havel. Really? Would you like to me? For me? Thank you so much. Okay, lead the way. Okay, let's go. There we go. Wait, right, thank you so much. You're welcome. What about the package? Oh, yes. Well, I'm quite behind my schedule now. Perhaps you could deliver the package to Noah for me? That way I can catch him on my other deliveries. I can do that. Great, here's the package. Huh? Uh, what's in this pocket? A luxury call? I've had this with me all the time. Oh, would you look at the time? Time to go. Thanks again. <laughs> okay, then. Time to heal. Yep. Yes. Also, time to switch pad a bit so I can get to level 11. I like the. Is it Beasel? Bez, Beasel? Beasel? Um, for. Beasel, yes. I like the Beasel stuff. It's Silk Quill. There we go. I like the Beasel stuff. It really helped level me up. It scared the ever-loving crap out of me, but it helped level me up. Okay, there you are. Do you have any news? I do. Tim sent the package, but the ring got delayed. Oh, what happened? I forgot killing cakes on his entire squad. Ah, can't show. Forgot what happened to the package. Took it over from. Got the package right here. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Doesn't matter. I can't use it. So, oh well. That's it. Parts. Operations and done. It should be fully operational now. Thank you. Yes, I'm just gonna say yes because I can't use it. Oh, 
Okay, so logbook. Yep. Of course, I can't use that. It's just I thought that was part of the quest. But nope. On we go then. I've looked through everything in Havel. There we go. Let's talk to this man. Oh. Wow, thank you so much for that. The road's now finally clear again. I'm bringing it back to parents for some more tree cutting practice. See you. Tree cutting practice. Okay. Woodlow forced. Hey, so you're a trainer, I see. So you've come to the right place. This forest is filled with trainers looking for a challenge. You look strong, so that won't be a problem, right? You can recognize other trainers by their gauntlet. If someone has one, they're probably a trainer that wants to be Coromon battle. Hey, but don't you... Shut up, man. But before I do any of that, I'm going to catch... Gonna catch me a Cormont. That's gonna be the end of this episode. Come on. What the heck? A wild Frova. That's a weird looking thing. Alright. Punch it. Slam. Eleven. Oh my god. Squad. Gonna have a problem. Okay. Attack 17. His is 16. His is 16. Okay. Um. No. Claw. 40. Slam. 40. So, squad, Taruga, send out. It's fine. He's weaker. I'm going to use this. Hopefully it's not 11. The other one was 11. Let this be lower than 11. Thank you. Okay. Takes a lot of stress off me. I think he's ice type. But it doesn't matter, because I'll be using a spinner to catch his Frova. One, two, three, and caught. Frova was caught. No, I would not. I'm trying to remember the names. Yes, why not? HP of 22, attack 10, special attack 11, special defense 9, speed, and soul sense. Ice. Rarity's rare. S oop. Scratch. 40, cut top. 20% increase crit chance. Hypnotize 80, that's a ghost type. Drain, it's magic. And have the special. And so his sets are special attacks higher. And scratching that, so okay. Man oh man. Can't lie, I was a little tense. But it's just looking at stats. <laughs> you know, same attack, lower stats. Yeah, it shouldn't do the same damage unless it's got a crit or something. Man. Super close. Yes, I would. Thank you. Okay. There we go. That's saved. So that's it all for th this episode. Let me switch this out. Actually, for that. That's all for this episode. If you enjoyed it, then make sure you watch the next episode and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want to buy a game, make sure you go to nixonart.com forward slash humble bundle and help charity and me. 
Anyways, that's all for this video. I'll see you in the next one, and retro on.